Well, hello everybody. Heroes of the Great Desire with a new a special filter, you might have seen in the description. Uh, this country, uh, Attila First Atheist, uh, this campaign uh, is a new campaign taking place in the uh, uh, the Charlemagne campaign map. And we're going to start off with the first battle of this campaign, which is actually starting off with the uh, the battle of the Catholian Plains, if I'm correct, if I'm pronouncing it right, I'm not sure. But uh, we're going to play against uh, the Huns, and we're going to get reinforcements, so I'm definitely going to fall back. Because I don't think otherwise we would win it. <laughs> because as you can see, our army is definitely not equipped to deal. Um, it's not equipped to deal with these types of enemies, as I would say. But, uh, well, who knows? Who knows, eh? Depends a bit what happens. Ah uh, well, this is our uh, cavalry. Our army is actually quite strong. We mostly got whole um, full armies. I do got some sub mods on for the campaign map, but that is only for that one. So you know that as well. It was a little bit different, but not totally. Yeah, I'm not sure what they are going to do, so yeah, we're going to get their uh, reinforcements from here, it seems like. Yeah, I'm not sure what they will do, but it's a bit, uh, a bit difficult. It's going to be a really interesting battle to fight. I have no idea what will happen, or are we going to win it or not, but the balance bar is not in our favor, as you might can see. We definitely have a bit le worse units, but... Um, we've got uh, 80 is over here. As you can see. Not bad. And here we've got our allies who are also attacking already. So it's definitely going to be a mess. And we're going to try and make the information. Because otherwise we will definitely... Definitely die, I would say myself. Uh, if we don't do that, we will be more or less in a really, really bad position. I will get to make sure that we have information. But again, it's going to be difficult to see if we can win this. They seem to actually quite good cavalry, although they don't have too much enemy. Uh, uh, like as I said, we have to be defensive, although we're not we're not defensive in the battle. So yeah, especially even even. Although we have more men, I think we have the worst men. Ah, that would be so enough I could control my allies. <laughs> Time we possibly would have a bigger chance. As you can see, oh, so many cavalry. So many cavalry units. And here we got, uh, oh, good, look at this. They actually are all together. Where is Attila? Where is Attila? Attila is actually of age in this one. Here we are. Honig Warlord. There you got him with his uh, Sword of Heaven, I think it is called. Yeah, right, Sword of Heaven. Sword. Oh my god, my ally, my ally is just not even in information, so I think they might be... Uh, if the infantry can like punch the charge, we might be okay. But if it can like reinforce them at some point, that will be more than be bad. If we can like try and kill off those guys, and then we can hit the flank from that way. Who knows? what will happen but again thank you all for watching um this is here i'm here as a degree so i'm mostly a total war youtuber but i also do tycoon gaming so again thank you for joining me today if you want to see more of these types of videos don't forget to hit that subscribe button and look up then the notification bell if you want to keep up to date so yeah again uh, this is a special future what this is that will like one episode or sometimes two depending on the game uh we'll test the mod out and then uh, we'll see uh, how to receive and so you guys are notified by it if you want to take a look on this mod yourself it will be in the description below um but um yeah it's definitely interesting oh god it's so bad oh they're all rotting out got a defector ah palatina yeah they're all so dead these are all gothic and uh i got these guys as well so Oh shit. Like oh
Uh, they also got, they got, not all of them are really good. They got some Skolle over here, those are Gothic mercenaries. They're now Goths. <laughs> if they can get into charging before they do, we might be in a, in a good situation, but depends a bit on how it will go. Let's fast forward a little. We're not doing too much. It would be quite nice if we had like uh Oh god no. Oh this is going to be interesting to see how our allies will do it out. But we we have to be we have we cannot run because if we run we'll be dead. That's basically a sentence. Oh god, okay here we go. Well we are marching. We have to be careful that we march in cohesion. If we don't do that we cannot really reform too easily if the time comes. So I'm gonna go back into this position to make sure that we will be Oh god. Oh god, oh, absolutely horrendous. Yeah, we will help when the time is there, but what they're now doing is absolutely ridiculous. Oh my god, this is going to be an absolute massacre, isn't it? Oh, that was actually a good charge. My my team. Oh god, yup, oh shit. Oh, it's so over. Oh my god, yeah, dead. Absolutely slaughtered. Oh my god, how on earth I'm going to win this? There's no way that's going to happen. Actually, right, so we can do that a little bit. Okay, this is a mess that we are definitely right now in. I'm going to reform the line, as I said, but we're going to try and do it like this. But now we are seeing this as the, f the, the main flank. Let our enemy, our allies, kill the enemy as much as they are able to, as you can see. Come on, give me that. Oh, okay. Uh, they have definitely killed more of us than the three of them, but they have, of course, mostly cavalry. So, as we can hold the formation steady, we would be in a good position. So we have to be careful, as I said. We have to be really patient. I also hired some mercenaries before this battle. I could do that still, so that was quite nice. Again, this is like basically a blob war. I can't not join uh, because that just would be a death sentence for me. And I rather, I rather wouldn't be in that situation. I should get my dad. Okay, does it does it does it um, doesn't mean cavalry unit? We might have to be taken care of. Oh, we have to be careful that he doesn't charge my units. And again. Oh, oh yeah, but, but nah, we're not yet even, so that's great. Um, Although we've left definitely those small. Oh, good job. Perfect. Very well done. Give him one more throw. Please. Now, come on, give me arm. Oh, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. That is a, such a bad thing that you did there. Yeah. Although they did, that's not bad. Oh shit! As I said, no cohesion, no battle line means death. All right, we have to be trying to get a bit around this now. All right, if we can have like a formation ready, we'll be fine. I believe. All right, let's fall back with this cover unit because he's being pulled into a battle I don't want to fight. Like he still, they still got their um, horse archers, so. If they can like come over here and fight me, I'm fine with that. Although I rather wouldn't. Yet at least. Very good. Okay, informations.
I, I really need you to hold actually your fire because you're like the only only ones that can fire upon their holes arches so please don't do that oh god all right if they can like harass them i'm fine with that i'm totally fine with that because then i can still do some stuff Oh no, oh, the, the, the horrible over the, oh, in the backfiring, <laughs> I forgot about that. <laughs> oh, that's like one of those things you never forget with uh, Attila, because that is such a, re such a bad mechanic, oh. Oh, shots. Yeah, you come over here and start um, coming around. Do not always like fire upon my units, please. Oh, correct. I'll fall back a bit and then you can start firing. Got to get into this position. I need a frenzy, come on! Alright. Fired wheel. Are you in frenzy? No, you are not yet. How on earth are we going to win this if my allies are so incompetent? Cool question, isn't it? Or am I. Okay. Oh my god, you actually lost! How did you... Oh, of course, that's that makes sense, actually. Alright, then. Absolutely horrendous. I had hoped that they would do a bit more of a good job against um, Archer Fire, but they absolutely didn't. Oh, fuck. Okay, I don't think we're going to win this. I don't think we will. If we can kill Attila though, that might just do the job. Like I'm not, I'm really surprised. Like they do so much, such a bad job at this. Bang, dude. <laughs> oh, oh my God, this is so bad. Oh God, this is going to be an absolute sacking of the of the Western part because. Iris, no. Like the thing is, my allies, I actually did quite a good job with killing most of their units, but they did such a bad job with it. But I mean, like, such a bad job. But mostly the cavalry they mismanaged. Like, absolutely mismanaged. Oh god. Shit. Come up! Ah oh, shit, AD is being attacked. Come on, Sally, Adius, please. Do not die, do not die. Ah oh, crap. Ah, uh, AD is being killed. Oh, I have to be getting out there because if I do not, I will be dead. Although he's. he is. he is. Come up, get me! Get me help! Get Adius out of there! I, I wouldn't mind losing the battle if I at least get, get Adius out. That would be great. Ugh. Please get me Adius out of there! Come on! Oh, you fucking idiots. Get out! F flee! Flee Adius. If you can get out, I would be so happy if that would be... I can't get out, get out, please, 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 fall back. Fall back! I just hope... I, I, I just hope that he can get out, but I don't, don't think that will be possible. Oh, God, Lord! Woo! He is wounded. Um, 
I think there might be a scripted idea. Uh, we made them pay though. Um, they got a thousand. They got like a thousand left. So uh, yeah, that was that. We were just outnumbered, and I think if we had like a coordinated line, we might have been in a better job. But they, they did. My 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 ally, my allies did such a bad job. Did Attila die? No, he absolutely lived and got 145 kills. Yeah. They have a sound left though, so that's still bad as well. We lost. That's unfortunate. Uh, history did not repeat itself. Like, I don't think what I could have done differently. Like, if they... I possibly think I could have... Our allies in command, but... Uh, yeah, we couldn't do much with our ally, that's the point. Yep, that didn't help, did it? But maybe our ally over here can do some things. Well, our, al our entire army is being destroyed. Holy shaps. Alright, so we have Lutricia still left. Although they actually also have lost most of what they had. So I, I wouldn't say it was a... It was definitely a Pyrrhic victory for them as well. And Lucia also has like a pretty decent... Ruling member. Scholar again. I would mind getting like someone who. Okay, champion rider. Let's get him because then he may be able to. Uh, to become a, a, a maybe a, the next heir to the empire because we only have we only have kids we have only yeah what is we only have some children so what do we okay so if anything uh, researched okay that's definitely interesting makes not much sense but okay so that means that all those units we had a second ago are all gone hmm. I'm curious to see what we will have in the right. As you can see, most of the cities are already upgraded, but they're not good. So, as you can see, we're now in the Attila map. And uh, Adi has got wounded. He will be back in a few turns, unfortunately. But he lived, so that's great. Um, we have... Um, we've got some territory in Slona, but I don't know how long that will be alive, because we've got the Physicots over here. And... Um, Oh yeah, we've got some allies as well, so yeah, like overall, we are in a bad spot, actually. Attila actually had some really decent-ish uh, battle men. He, yeah. Attila actually also has some strong gold, if I'm correct. Um, but I'm pretty still ranking 1, and uh, he's over here, with his uh, small uh, thing, small uh, army. Oh no, we've got a Gauls, Britannia, Jews, Salian Franks, they're my allies, Supreme Franks, we got Frisians, and we got the Alamans who are my allies, if I'm correct. No, they're not, they, they are, uh, I'm not sure what they are. The Alamans are just Alamans, who might just attack us. So hopefully we could do some trading with them. But what I would say is that we could try and get make peace with factions or the war with what I think are these guys as well. Now we're all the physicots. Nope. Admire strong empire. I am a strong empire. Ooh. Yeah, as I said, so we now have what we have to go and do try is try and make every government that is unhappy happy. Slumps. We have MVS slumps. We have enough food here, no we don't. So we've got uh, Christiana as the main influence. Um, get, I suppose we will remove this guardhouse and then we'll put down a lizard and extra uh, for sanitation. Over here we actually have slums again, so we have to try and remove it. We already have enough sanitation over here and public order, right? Yeah, okay, that's good. Over here we do as well, but we still have 
ruins. So we can remove that. Um, and also enough sanitation, that's great too. Although not totally, so let's get increase this one as well. Um, or maybe we're moving out to get sanitation. Over here we have to lose knots, but alright, that's fine. Let's remove this one so we can hopefully get a sanitation building going as well. Um, Boromaki, we have like a Latin chapel, but we got a fountain, so let's increase that one to hopefully increase our overall sanitation. And maybe some people build as well when we have uh, something different. And hopefully we can try and get this over up towards the next level by getting some some points some different uh, factions. If we go to summary, we got mostly that and Christianity still, so that's good. Uh, move Rome. Rome actually has some good units, but that no, 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 none of them actually have any building mechanics, like for buildings. Doesn't go good. And none of them have like um, infantry to recruit. We can possibly do that in Rome, I would say. And we got uh, our emperor's uh, army. Seems like he cannot actually recruit too good. So let's do that too. Found of gambling ruling house overqualified. Oh, that's not bad. So let's start recruiting. Um, again, so I think right now we have to pause for a second and see what we can do more. So. Uh, this is the campaign map, and um, uh, we're also going to take a look at all the playable factions after we've like, done maybe one turn ending and what we can do. So, this is basically where you start off with us the Western Roman Empire. Um, we actually have uh, an Eastern Expedition over here, or are they called? And they're called the, uh, the East Roman Expedition to help us out, I suppose. I'm not sure. The Bavarians. And uh, that is all that we can do for now. Um, can we actually change up something here? Because I'm pretty... Oh! Now this is all chorus garrisons, I think. So, that's definitely unfortunate. I think, I, th I think we can remove one. Especially over here, because we're not, we don't necessarily have any enemies over here. Except for the Vandals. Oh. Okay, that makes a difference. Regium was it? Yeah, Regium does actually. Okay, let's do not Regium. Let's do this one because we seem to have this one as well. Uh, we could increase the food because we're definitely going to see starvation sooner or later because we're going to find the uh, hunger. This isn't great, but we can get like one of these. Although, I'm not sure. Yeah, we don't have enough sanitation, though. That's a bit unfortunate. Yeah, but we need food. So, hopefully, that will also increase the overall like uh, food population. Ah, I think we can still get some... Um, can be awarded to generals in your faction when they reach a certain age or rank. Loyalty and influence are both increased by this, meaning offices have useful but potentially dangerous individuals. Um, let's get in into the province of, uh, I don't know. Which ones are unhappy? Um, which ones are unhappy? Reddy? Yeah, that's basically a, ooh. That is such a difficult province going to behold. What's that? Where's that? Also over here? Oh shit. Okay. And Although I must say the garrison is not too bad. Hopefully we can get that uh, done. Uh, increased. Not too quickly it seems like it. Garganensis I suppose we can do as a province. It's actually over here. It's not too bad. Let's um, remove the one in here so we can also start building something different. Uh, yeah, I'm fine. Uh, and Tarkanensis, uh, Caesarea, yeah, we have to keep that because otherwise we don't have any sort of garrison in the frontier. 
Yeah, over here as well with slum still, so I'll remove those. And that's all. So let's give him command of Garganensis. Why not? Let's put him in Garganensis. And you are going to put in. But you're not also happy. Um. Uh, God, yeah, for me. Uh, those ones are so small. I suppose Belgia we could do. Let's see Belgia. Belga. Belgia 1. Let's do N2 and then we can choose which ones we want. So we have food exported? No. Christian mission? No. Nah. Corruption? Non Latin Christianity. Uh, So the will decrease are full, but we, we don't have that much food, do we? Um, I think food is the problem anyway. Yeah. We could remove. We could convert this to a fishing jetty to get at least some food. And if we do this one as well, we also get some food. So if we convert this at some point, we will be okay with food. And removing like one level, this one possibly wouldn't hurt too much either. And what are those? The pirates, of course, the pirates. Puppets of those guys. <laughs> so we've got pirates, got vandals, we've got all lots of problems, it seems like it. Jeez. <laughs> but we've got some money to do, do it with, so at least we are in that account. Set. Although I'm not too sure if it has to do with the trade. Yeah, trade actually gives you quite a lot of money as well, as well as the taxes, so. The trade tab. That's good to know. So let's enter it and see what we can do against this situation as well as where we're going. Maybe he would be nice and goes to attack him. That would be great. But let's go and see. And we're back in a sec. Oh, as you can see, we still got some things of the Charlotte Gamain that uh, seems to be not be able to... Uh, <laughs> can be done, but okay, fine. <laughs> um, Political favors, definitely. Alright, so we got some money again, that's, that's great. Um, over here, we're going to build this one to help with that one. I already see that, uh, I already did saw that there are a couple of factions trying to get um, into our sphere of influence. And I'm not sure these guys were attacked, so we might be able to take them out. Mm, can we do that with like two? I think we might be able to. Would be a risk though. Although I say that also we have these guys closer, nah, let's don't, don't let's don't take it, right? Possibly not the smartest way to go. Uh, these guys are also unhappy. Yeah, destroy one more so we can build something good. Uh, where is this one? This one is over here. This one is quite important to keep safe. Right, so we got slums all destroyed. So we're going to build over here. Recruitment hub, I suppose. Uh, Geneva, we're going to destroy with that one. Uh, let's build a rally field. Oh god, where are you going? Just ease off. No, no, no. So over here. Nah, okay. Not bad. We're almost good with food, so let's convert this over to trade jetties. And, um. Any more things that we can do. Over here we can build this one. Uh, can have recruitment up, I would say. It's not bad. Um. At your command. Oh, yeah, 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 definitely get them. I'm not sure which ones are actually in this province. Baloga, Alekia, okay, Runa. Eglim is just a normal city. Dreskum is an... Okay, is it really a relatively garrisoned city? So I don't think these guys can do much against them. I would say. I'm not sure, of course. Uh, what we're going to do is actually possibly move. Ah, oh, shit. I forgot about that part. Uh, there's more. It's a bit unfortunate, but okay. Can happen. Oh, yes. Because we cannot, we cannot get let them... Uh, get these mercenaries. 
Ah, uh, here you go. First victory for Valentinian. Kill him. Oh, you yeah, gotta be kidding. Alright, so... From what I can tell, not too much. But, at least we have something. Um, build this one, thank you very much. Oh no, we actually have relative two here, but not in the main province. So what I will do is possibly remove this one. Oh no, this one we're actually we're actually already repairing. So I would say remove this one, so we can build salt, and we can both build this up because this one is more adjacent to all provinces. I'm correct. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. Over here, building um, recruitment fields. Here, I would say we would like to get some food fields again. A bit more food. Let's get some cattle. Um, over here, still removing. Uh, fruit orchards or wine. Let's get with a few fruit. Okay then, um, I think that is all that we can do for the moment. And I think I'm also going to leave uh, possibly this campaign here, to be honest. Atium versus that. Ah, that's being attacked soon. So it doesn't really matter too much if I keep it, does it? And I don't think I will be able to keep it anyway, but let's just hold that off for now. Um, I think I'm going to leave there, everybody. Um, this is the start of the campaign of the Atheus versus the Tilla map. Uh, we're also going to go to the campaign map to see which kind of factions you have as well. So I'll be back in a second. Well, here we're at the start of the campaign, or campaign map, I would say. But anyway, um, let's go to the Gru Shixi Felicis Aegis Visotilla. Then you can see we have Western Roman Empire. We've got the honey, that over here in the front of the map. Jesus, Adrian from forming tributary states, tribute from puppet masters, puppet states, and so we go. Not bad. Um, battle, we got the physicals by Tudoric over here. We've got the Sicilian Franks over here. Hmm, that's interesting. We got the Jutes, who are, uh, of course, the Nords over here and there. They've got like two little settlements. Uh, we've got the South Saxons. And uh, we have the uh, angles over here as well. As last one, the Fens are the Britons. So those are the factions and starting positions. Um, again, you start off with the battle, uh, battle of the Catalan Plains. I suppose it depends on you if you want to fight that battle. I might have actually could have done what I could have done. Is maybe wait and let them attack me. I'm not sure if they would have done it. But uh, that's what you can do in this campaign or mods. Play against uh, Attila as he is older. And you can of course also start as Attila when he is um, of age. Instead of having to go through what I think is a bit... Uh, yeah, a bit of an un really weird campaign line. but So you cannot really use him until you're actually really strong enough. You've got to ready some factions and guys. So anyway... That's that. Again, thank you for watching. If you think I deserve a like, please leave a like down below. And if you want to see more of these types of videos, don't forget to hit, hit that subscribe button uh, down below and, and the no notification bell. Again, thank you for watching. If you want to see, check out this mod for yourself, link to, them, uh, link to that is down in the description below. And I hope to see you on the next one. Have a great day, and i see you all later. Bye-bye.